Welcome back to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT. Nah, I'm IT Explosive One. We are playing the compliment. Compliment. The complex. complex. Oh, we're brave, dude. We're 63% brave. We got some bravery. I wonder if uh, that like lady we saved is going to come back into the picture. Uh, Maybe. I mean, what's our percent on that other girl? It's white on white, so I can't read the uh, number. Mindy, the the dying one. Oh, forty three. It looks. Oh, like. she's mad at or us. Or forty one. So the only person we have a positive 41. interaction rate with is the girl we saved her life, and I don't really understand how our actions have really affected anyone else yet. Yeah, like I don't know how we even have a relationship with Burgundy. Like we <laughs> we've literally like seen him on one call, but, right? And he was just like, I need to study the blueprints. And the, the doctor who we've been spending the majority of our time when we have no, there's nothing. no, And family. it hasn't changed since the first scene. I know. We had that whole little beautiful scene with the vent and nothing happened. Yeah, right? he she he took the beans <laughs> that we had, dude, and just, he, right. he was good, dude. All right, we get to find out this girl's Absolutely. information. Always. Give me the microfilm. She's got a cut finger, dude. Find out what happened. Just give me the microfilm. <laughs> you take the microfilm? It is it laced? Put it in your mouth. Wait. That was anticlimactic. <laughs> oh. Oh wow. That spit blood at her, dude. That's pretty. That wack. was kind of effed up. Is that how you feel? It's kind of whack, dude. All right. It's on her shirt, dude. Oh, burn that stuff, fam. <laughs> Picnic. She files Kensington and Picnic. Picnic. Which one do you want to watch? We got to watch Kensington. I, That's think, the I think it's a trick question, dude. Oh. This gets over, we'll be answering to the UN. Kensington, Ma. What's the problem? We quashed uprising villages. And you got human trials to assess your technology. To burn one stone. The three whole villages. Your scientists need not know how the data was acquired. The supreme leader is a man of discretion. We trust you are the same. Most certainly. No, sure. she's in on it. Well, we will. knew it. They were using the nanoparticles and candor? I guess so. My mind's thinking the same thing as yours, so do you really want to watch the other video? Play it. Please. You sure? Actually, I'll probably not play it. Look, look. You've forgotten the wine, but remembered your phone. Typical. Nina's mad at me these days. <laughs> well, I'm sorry I forgot the wine, okay? Yeah. Brought onion bhajis, egg mayo, <laughs> tomatoes. <laughs> Claire takes too many selfies in life. They called it egg mayo. Not that much. <laughs> look, look, I'm showing the surroundings. Look, look. Look how pretty this grass is. Come Aww. on, let's, let's take a picture. These the were your, this was your life. <laughs> now that's... Wow. What happens when you get nanoparticles in you? Nano parts, dude. That's what you're doing with your research, your precious research. Killing innocent people in candor. With your nanites. Huh. Yeah, take a good look at yourself. Go sit in the corner. You see. Yeah. Ten minutes in the corner. Bye. Make your way downtown, dude. Talk fast. The Korean government, Natalie Kensington, experimented with your nano cells on my people, my village, my parents, my sister Nina. Mm. They're all killed for opposing the dictatorship. Natalie was making duplicates of the master badge behind my back. And selling it as my tech killed people. Chemical warfare. And you were taking all the evidence from my six. No. In that USB and in your veins. 
Now the Supreme Leader has activated a sleeper cell in the complex to cover his tracks. Yeah, not to mention Natalie's. Why didn't you tell us this before? I no didn't way. trust you. Oh my god, now you do? She looks a lot like Mila Kunis, dude. Answer the call. Let's talk. Let's yeah, just see what she has to say. We're answering all the calls. Oh, yeah. No, I don't want to miss it. Reject call. Amy, we need to take a minute and think about this, okay? I'm fine. He I'm wouldn't let me do it. Wow. I know a rush decision when I see one. Are you not going to expose Natalie? After we, what you've just seen. We need to deal with our current predicament. I'll need you mansplaining how to r run my life, sir. <laughs> right? No, in fact, call Natalie. <laughs> Screw this. Would you believe this isn't the weirdest place I've taken a ship? Do you need me to stay and help you? Ye no, no, you find your spot. <laughs> Ye no. Do you need me to help you wipe your A? <laughs> hey, speak it out of here. Will you quit like that? How you healthcare said. workers Pass. think. <laughs> Never thought I'd have to answer that question. Like, am I supposed to help oh, you with do this? Right you always do. A habit I wish I had. Well, I might have rubbed off on you if you'd stuck around. Oh, here's their touching moment. Why'd you leave, Reese? Yeah, why did you leave? Answer the question. The absurdity. Not knowing whether... Saving someone was the right thing to do if it condemned them to a life of pain. It's too much for me. Coward isn't the man for you anyway. That wasn't your call to make. We were a team. Hindsight's a bitch, eh? Heard of Mr. Cracking Fortnite in Eritrea. Where can I sign up for this war tour and world tour you guys were on? Uh, find out more or ignore. Find out more, dude. Yeah, let's find out more. Enough with the wise cracks, Claire. I'm not in the mood. She's like, B, I have you. feel, Amy? You lost people that you love. My feelings are trivial compared to yours. The sense of betrayal, I mean. Come on, give us a break. I meant Natalie. It was a dream come true, getting an internship here. Village girl from Kindar, coming to London to work, to live, to love. Funny story. <laughs> On my first day here, I was super late. So I, I went to a Starbucks a in the <laughs> and got a Big Turns Mac. Out I was looking at the tourist tube map, the disused and unfinished stations. Yeah, that's right, the um, half-built station under the complex. Tabitha Greens. We're so far underground, we must be right on top of it. Ooh, foreshadowing. Dun, dun, dun. You're right. Yeah. We're right above Tabitha Greens. Yeah, you might be right, Claire. Thank huh? you. Anytime. Push me and my iron long onto the unfinished subway. <laughs> we can't go across the void. We tried going up into the vent, but we haven't tried going down. Oh, she's good at going down. Let's have the greens. <laughs> Get a shovel. We might have one. Reese is sitting on it. The toilet goes into the subway? Uh, it might. What'd you have to know? No. I need Maybe. something that will remove the entire toilet quickly. Um, we always got that microscope. Chemistry? Uh, let's try chemistry. Yeah, what the hell? Chemistry? I like the smart You're thinking. You're going to get your hands dirty. Not necessarily. Okay, let's MacGyver our way yeah. in here. We need some borax. She's got some borax, strip some batteries. Yeah. She's uh, like, if I strip these, take these strips of lithium off of this battery. Uncoil the battery, the wrap it around the base of the, of the toilet, get a little spark from magnesium, and... <laughs> yeah, okay, Amy, but there's a toilet in the way. Not for long. Potassium. Amy. My favorite ever chemistry lesson was when the teacher put a small piece of potassium in water. Boom. 
I always wanted to see what a full block would do. It's going to blow it up. <laughs> That's all it did. <laughs> I mean, shot a piece oh, of porcelain out. Of a little porcelain chunk. <laughs> So now the big question, how far below us is Tabitha Green's? How do you even... Wait, up, hold up. I'm not going down a toilet chute. It's not even a chute. Where's the pipe, dude? <laughs> it blew a man-sized hole all the way down. <laughs> uh, drop something small, drop something big, or drop Amy. Drop, drop something... something big. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Oh, <laughs> one of the bodies? I mean... Hey... Hey, Reese. It's kind of what you want to know. Can you help me with something? You See wanna, if he gets stuck. Yeah, you want to know if a body can get down there. Easy does it. They better have took the terrorist guy. Should have used the pony. I'm sure that is who they take. Yeah, it looks like him. Oh, whoa. What? The Wilhelm scream. He wasn't Falling dead. for you. Fine. He was alive. He was alive the whole time. It said he was dead in our stats. Why would we ever think he wasn't? Let me check the stats, dude. Is he really dead now? <laughs> yeah, wait a second. Like, why he would likes we... likes us even less now. <laughs> yeah, why would we have ever thought he wasn't... No. I don't Anyways, know. Anyways, All right. I thought he was dead when he was alive. Now we're just shooting at the door. All that hacking did nothing. Now we're just shooting at the door. Their bullets won't dent these doors. They were built to withstand much more than that. The Void's last resort defense mechanism is the kicker. When it detects a rogue pathogen, it generates a white heat flash to eliminate the threat. A white heat <laughs> flash. That sounds amazing. She's already hardwired into the system. We are fucking fucked. There's a lot of okay. hall. <laughs> Guys, the intruders are almost in and we know why they're here. Parker, what options have we got? Enough! While Parker was accessing the lab security mainframe for bypasses, we saw records of who gained entry in the last 24 hours. Okay. Claire entered using someone else's ID credentials. Yours, Amy. That's impossible. I've got my ID card right here. Amy didn't help me. I snuck into her office and I copied her credentials off a computer. You're the liar, Natalie. You don't have a voice here, Claire. But we know about <laughs> Kinder. Reese. We have proof. Mm, facts. Look. Nonsense. Look, the intruders are Natalie and Kinder's way of making sure that we die with their dirty little secret. We know that you hack your own security, Natalie. That's ridiculous. Yeah, That's you're ridiculous. Such a sucks, even resacting easily. Reese has been hacking the system. He isn't an employee here, is he? What's your story, buddy? He spent the last few years bouncing between pharma companies around the world. A mercenary. Oh, wow. Who side do you want, Wakefield? Continue to accusations. I'm back. Yes, Emily, I got you. I thought you said that you did your due diligence. Slack on your part. Seriously? Our access to Kensington Corporation is only second to yours, Natalie. That's ridiculous. I'd never. Even Parker showed up unannounced. Don't drag me into this. Well, come on. Everyone knows you work for anyone who pays your quote. I mean, isn't that the case with everybody? All I know right? is that if they get in, the nanocells are gone forever. Natalie, please. Look, we aren't traitors. Help us. Stall them. Do something. She don't care, dude. Nope. Amelia. Regardless of what we think of each other, right? Amelia. Amy, Amelia. Oh, I didn't realize that was short. I didn't either. Parker. So we're trusting these guys now? Yes, we are. Can the void jam electronics? Negative. Could you reinitialize the vacuum? Two of them aren't wearing helmets. I can't. They've locked us out. Reese could. His computer down there is hardwired into the system. All right. Okay, tell me through it as fast as you can. <laughs> They're gonna vacuum their heads. There we go, that's a good idea. Oh, give us some morphine now. Help, baby! Help, I'll declare. Help. Yeah. I'm oh, not gonna let her die. That's now she's flatlining, dude. Something wrong. My heart. 
Well, yeah, everybody else that took a man cells died, girl. It's called love, Claire. And I love <laughs> you, too. <laughs> oh, she's crying blood no. now. You don't have to wear a mask. No. I trust you. Why? She just spit in your face like 20 minutes ago. Yeah, but... You... Girl, you have a cut on your finger. We came to help. This lady's a doctor, and she's not very pathogen-friendly, dude. She's like, in the opening scene, she pulled her mask off in the... in the tent. <laughs> she got spit in her face, dude. She's like, I trust you. You ain't gonna spit in my face again. Uh, that, that one's a little iffy. Oh, look at... Flipping Tom Cruise in Mission Impossible I here. I know, dude. F <laughs> Freddy Fingers over here. He's got it. Did Parker tell you how to turn the vacuum back on? He... did. Alright, what are we doing? Oh, oh, here comes the hot white so flash. So smug now, are ya? <laughs> You should put your ski mask back on. Or yeah, why did they take off their ski masks? <laughs> I don't know. To give their characters All right, a chance still to shine. Alright, there's still a lot to do. One down, two to go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. The worst sock scene in a movie goes to... Yeah. That Crazy looked, man with a newsie. Oh, that man. looked awful. Tech nine, I guess it was. <laughs> that looked awful. Oh, man. Oh, but that that does that looks bad. <laughs> Did they get in? No, he died. Did His dude? eyes are getting awful red, dude. So like these guys are falling over. Oh wow, he just he shot, shot his, his friend. The guy who's hacking, he why is he not feeling the effects and he got shot? Why do you okay? Wait a minute, so is this a triple cross? Is this a triple cross? Oh, he got the helmet on, so he's good, dude. Is this the is that the investor from the It's not. I don't think it is. But I'm still kinda... But they didn't get in. <clears throat> Call Natalie Kensington. And then there was one. And then there was one. But okay. Answer call. Oh thank God. We saw the lab door didn't open. Good work, Wakefield. Appreciate the guidance, Parker. Thanks for the lead, Natalie. There's still an armed intruder out there. Parker, what else do you have for us? I could go for Natty's internet, unplug the lab, plug it back in. That will kill lockdown mode. <laughs> That'll and the work. It might work. 60 seconds. You guys can then escape before everything initializes. Emily has a security team poised to handle the last intruder. No, that's a shit plan. He's, He's standing right outside the door. Too. Fucking security team of sprinters wouldn't make it down before he wastes us. He's right, Parker. It's a calculated risk worth taking. Okay, well, when could you do this? Whenever you're... When you get Claire's blood. What the fuck, Natalie? Yes, I know it will kill her, but she's gonna die anyway. What she the... could sacrifice herself <laughs> to save millions. You can't tell her that. Think, Amy. She can hear everything. We can't start over again. This has been our lives for the past four years. We're not the only country trying for nanocells. I'm not a murderer. You're a monster, Kensington. Just take the blood, Amy. Time is running out. Deal or no oh, deal? Oh, we're not taking the blood, dude. No deal. No deal. No deal. No, nah, dude, we know she's <clears throat> she killed the whole village, dude. End call. Yeah. in the corner here, Emmy. There has no to be deal. another way that doesn't involve killing Claire. There isn't. We're trapped. Yeah, by Natalie. The lab's she in lockdown mode because way. she ordered it. There's no other chemical threat outside of Claire's bioprotector. Yeah, there is. Actually. Oh, we'll find out on the next episode oh. what it is. Oh. That is all the time we have today's episode of Crazy Towns, folk. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you already done that, hit the notification bell. It'll tell you when we do new content for Jonas. T -T. We are out.